Hi guys, uh, my name is Steve Powell from PowerPlate and I'm going to take you through uh, my exercise of the month. It's going to be a clean and press. Uh, we're going to regress it and we're going to progress it and, and have a play with it. Okay, so the, the start point of the exercise really is we're going to be using the cables, which allows us to add resistance to the exercise. So we take a traditional XXX stance, so feet hip to shoulder width apart. First part of the movement is into a squat, so we're into a squat from this position, so when we load the cables at shoulder height, and then press to the ceiling. So one of the key checkpoints, particularly because we're on vibration, is that in the press phase, the knees stay off lock. So at no time are we locking and extending the legs so that the, the muscles stay loaded under tension. So start, start position, from here, we clean into the shoulders, stand to press. So just a couple, a couple more times, clean to the shoulders, drive with the arms to just above head height. So we're going to take it back a stage, let's regress it slightly. So what we're going to do is take out the press. So we can come here and we just clean and stand. So we load and we stand. So we're taking out the press, so we're taking out the overhead movement. So again, feet position stays exactly the same, load and stand. So if we want to challenge our client maybe a little bit more, let's progress it. So we come back to the original start position. So just for one more time, the traditional exercise to squat and a press. So the first change we're going to make is just to change the footprint. So we take RXX, exactly the same motion, load to the shoulders, press above the head. So all we've done here is we change the lines of stress to the body, particularly because we're on vibration as well. And obviously we make sure that we change that to LXX through the boot to the press at the top. Our next progression, so let's stay in LXX, is we're going to go with a unilateral arm drive as well. So if we come here, we then drive, so we take it into a rotational press. So base position, we clean, and we press. So the movement when it comes together is dynamic and it's fluid. We take the resistance from the cables, we add it to vibration, and we give our clients a very dynamic global movement for their workout.